Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It is stinking hot out. Stinking hot. So I'm out for a solo overnighter tonight. marshy section of the lake and uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and try to find a camp for the night. There's no like designated campsites here at all. Um, I'm gonna try to find something a little bit interesting that works and uh, got my hammock for tonight be my first time hammock camping, basically. So that'll be kind of cool. And then once I set up camp and have everything ready to go for tonight, I'll come back out and do some fishing. I think it's way too hot to do any fishing now anyways. It's a scorcher. This is the spot. This rock up there. Put my hammock on this tree here. That's quite the view. This is camp. I'm gonna hang my hammock between these two trees. They both look very decently healthy. Healthy enough for one night anyways. Canoes down there. Check out that view. And then this view. Super pretty. Um, so I'm going to clear this area out and have a fire. There's a bit of a dip here. I think it'll be perfect for my fire. And uh, this is all rock too, so this is just a bunch of moss I need to clear away. And then that's a pretty steep drop there, down to my canoe. Camera probably doesn't do it any justice, but it's very cool here. There is nothing like chilling in a hammock. Oh, it's so nice. I'm not going to set up the tarp yet, because I kind of like to just be able to chill in here and see the view. But uh, I'll do that later. This is a killer spot. That view though. I'm just gonna make a real simple small little fire today because 
it's a little bit windy and there isn't a whole lot of like area right here to make a good fire so it's really hot out though I don't need anything other than to cook yeah all as well might have to go find a rock to put down um, it's definitely stone under here like like shield but there is quite the root system that goes for quite a ways till you actually hit the rock so I think the safest thing would be to try to just put rocks down to have my fire on like I said I'm not having a very big one but um, this might be a little safer <laughs> So, got them all. It's not like the best, <laughs> but um, it's more than enough room for a little fire that I need, and uh, might give me an ex enough structure too to like lay my lay my uh, my pan out to get a good little kind of cooking station type situation. Anyways, this is what we're doing. These are slanted, so they'll keep the fire a little bit contained over here, which is it's slanting down this way, so. It's perfect. And then this is well off the ground. Should protect the root system. It'll be good. some sticks. Oh yeah. That's cool. Guys, I've never done this before. This is awesome. Amazing how relaxing this is. Hammocks are awesome. My headlamp out too because I'm going to need it soon. dinner. I don't know how well you guys can see me. Got it. Oh my gosh, it's so hot. I've got some vermicelli, which is like rice noodles. 
I've got some jerky for a snack. I've got another beer that I'm going to crack now because it's already super warm anyways. Like, so warm. Anyways, I have some cheese. A little bit of cheese. Got some mushrooms. I've got a sausage that I'm going to cook in a pan with a little bit of butter and the vermicelli. I think it's going to be real good. Got my butter. A little bit of that in there. Little, a lot, whatever. Same thing. Hey, that took all of two seconds. With titanium, you want the fire like really, really not hot because it'll just warp the crap out of how, how thin this is. I'm going to cut up the mushrooms as well. These stupid little flies keep landing on me. It's really annoying. They're not doing anything or biting or anything. It's just so... Add just a bit of water so it cools it down a little bit. Since I'm doing the water, I could probably add some of the rice noodles. Kind of using the mushroom, sausage, and the uh, butter for flavor. So. on there to melt. Yeah. The noodles worked out. They're nice and fluffed up now. That's cool. Okay. There's ready. And then uh, I'm honestly so wiped. I'm just gonna go to bed after this. So wait. Then hopefully try to wake up early tomorrow. Wow, this turned out amazing. I was not expecting that at all.
Oh yeah. It's so good. Considering there's I didn't add any salt or anything. That's friggin' good. Alright, I'm gonna finish this up. I'll get back to you when I'm getting ready for bed. I'm using my canoe as a bridge through all this crap to get to the water and clean my dishes. All cleaned up. Time to pack everything up for the night. So this thing has a little hook on it. This hooks up like that. And I can see what I'm doing. Put my reflectors in there. I have no idea if this is going to work or not. I'm really hoping it does though. Hello guys, I'm all ready for bed. I had a pretty good day. It was a, little, a lot warmer than I would have appreciated, for sure. <sighs> but, um, it's okay. If I had more, more time, I would have gone for a swim, probably, but I didn't bring a towel or anything to dry off with before bed, so. I have to cover my ears tonight. The bugs are annoying. But not, not bad. They're not biting or anything. Anyways, guys, I hope you're enjoying this so far. Thanks for sticking with me, and uh, I will see you guys in the morning.
So it would have been smart to put put some wood under my tarp last night. <laughs> kind of struggled this morning. Um, but overall, I had a good night. <clears throat> Woke up around 6.30, 7 o'clock. I can't believe how warm it was last night and how warm it still is. It's so humid. It's crazy. I'm not going to bother with the oatmeal, this is more than enough. Woo! That's why this site is dangerous. Ugh. picked up so it's not so muggy it's still pretty hot though if I'm in a if I'm in a tank top it's hot 
because I get cold very easily. Well, that's it for this video, guys. I, uh, I had a really good time out here. Hopefully the next time I come out, uh, Grizz will be feeling up to it and back to his normal self. I hope, I hope so, I hope. Um, but yeah, thank you guys very much for tagging along with me on this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave me a, a, a thumbs up and please subscribe if you haven't already. It really, really helps my channel and I really appreciate it. And that's it, guys. I guess I'll see you on the next video. Bye.